So last weekend, the OHSAA crowned new girls state champions. Fort Wormie and Versailles took home the hardware in Divisions 3 and 4. The Lady Tigers earned their second girls basketball state title with senior Lauren Bruns leading the way. 16 points and 8 rebounds for Bruns. This week's OIO Prep Profile highlights the two-sport athlete who won a state title in volleyball in her junior year. And now Bruns' high school career comes to an end as a basketball state champ. We are Tigers! It finally settled in uh, probably about a day or two ago. Uh, you know, you wake up and you're like, it hits you and it's a, a great accomplishment. And, you know, I think it's even better that we kind of went in and not many people expected us to, so to come out with the title, it's something that I think I'm really proud of and I'm really proud of my teammates for it. She did not want to lose. That was the one thing that I saw in her from the very first game of the season was she wasn't going to lose. It, that she doesn't take losing, you know, she, she doesn't accept losing. And that was great to have as a captain because I knew I could count on her to put the girls on her shoulder and, and take them through. Bruns accomplished many individual milestones this season, including setting the school record for most three-pointers in a season. But she's most proud of her team and how they came together to accomplish what many people thought they couldn't. This team was so close this year. I think once we stepped on the floor, we were immensely ready to go, but right when we got off, you know, we were joking and having a good time again. And I wouldn't have wanted to win a state title with anyone else. It's just something that we never thought of after we lost so many seniors last year, but the girls wanted it so bad starting about halfway through the season that you could see it in their face. And I just, I, I wanted it so bad for them. It couldn't have ended any a better way, you know. Uh, winning state in volleyball would have obviously capped it off even better, but just to end it at my career at Versailles with a state title makes it undescribable. Lauren says she has a love for basketball that will never go away. But she also happens to be very good at volleyball. Bruns can't wait to continue her volleyball career at the University of Dayton in the fall. I started playing club volleyball for one team and he had a good uh, relationship with that coach and they kept in contact with me and I think last about last March is whenever I committed with them and it was just the right fit. I loved everything about the campus and the coaches and the teammates. She is one of the hardest workers in the classroom and outside the classroom on the court. She, even in school, she, she works extremely hard. I have her in math class and she's always in my class asking how can I, how can I do this problem or how can I get better. Uh, on the court she's the same way. I can see that in the, on the volleyball court and the basketball court. She's always determined to be her very best. Lauren will take that positive attitude with her to college. Bruns is so grateful for her time at Versailles, and she plans to use what she has learned as a Tiger to succeed at the next level. You know, cherish every moment you have on the floor. The four years at Versailles went so by, by so fast, and I couldn't have been more thankful for the friendships I've made with not even just my team, with my teammates, but with my coaches. And the community here at Versailles is awesome, so I'm going to give my 100% at UD and hopefully get some more uh, titles there. A perfect end to a fantastic high school career. Congrats to Lauren and the Versailles Lady Tigers.